2022 Kia Tutelage. Maybe it's pronounced. Not sure. Um, invoice. QuickBooks. For those guys who are by yourself and you're still handwriting invoices on pieces of paper the old-fashioned way that I used to do 30 years ago. Um, a very simple introductory to some software that isn't a full-blown version of a shopware, which is very good, and other things that are might be a little expensive for you when you first start out and you don't have your game down yet. Uh, an entry would be QuickBooks. None of them are the greatest peach tree or any of those other accounting and tax type softwares. Nothing's perfect, but at least with something like QuickBooks, it's already set up for you. It's made for dummies, so it's great for me. And um, you can put your parts list in it. So every time a part comes in, or every time you purchase a part to put on a vehicle, you can start building up an inventory of prices and parts and everything like that without purchasing something, unless you have a direct link with one of your jobbers, um, your warehouses where you get to use their software and you get all the parts or anything, but you could start adding that in QuickBooks. So you go, you could take a picture of this item, you can enter it with a part number and price and it would be stored up there. And the next time you need that item, you can scroll down on it, hit it, call it up. There'll be a picture to prove it's the part that you want. You could do that with QuickBooks. Um, pricing. So this is a 2020 to Kia YF refrigerant, 950 grams. So that's a little over two grams. I mean, two pounds of refrigerant for those of you who use pounds. And so we come over here and so we came back, we did the recovery several days ago. So refrigerant, first I analyzed the refrigerant. Uh, there was a little waste oil, about five milliliters were, was removed on this. Uh, the refrigerant removed, oh, I didn't put in the amount on here. It was just like at two pounds. The recovery charge, uh, 0.4 hours, 220, or actually $212 an hour. So at 0.4, that's $84 to recover the refrigerant. The process to recover refrigerant, the labor incurred is $84. Uh, then came back and it's time to check right now. So I did a nitrogen pressure decay test. I did a vacuum decay test. Parts would be things like your uh, tracer dye, your refrigerant oil, your refrigerant. So that's that now the refrigerant all by itself you have the yf refrigerant and the yf refrigerant at 207 dollars and 66 cents a pound and we have a little over two pounds so we got 2.094 pounds that comes up to 434 dollars just for the refrigerant there's your trace dye we add the trace dye manufacturer's compressor refrigerant oil uh, perform a leak test, then recharge labor 1.4 hours at $212 an hour. So you got $296.80 there. Uh, we got our EPA and we got our BAR, what's required here. Those are all the snapshots, the screenshot shots of the recordings that you've seen in my other videos that get included in every invoice. And that's the car, Toodle, Toodle Ride to ride or however you say this Kia and it's a dual evaporator so this is an extra large dual evaporator system and that's why it requires so much refrigerant all right guys that's a quick one here I'm about to charge this up and uh, put two pounds in here YF refrigerant uh, come back on the next video see you